By the time you're eight weeks pregnant, your baby is called a fetus, which means offspring. The legs are getting longer. The different parts of the leg are not properly distinct yet. It'll be a bit longer before the knees, ankles, thighs and toes develop. A close-up view of your little embryo would reveal your baby is looking a lot less reptilian and a lot more baby-like. Even though baby has webbed hands and feet, teeny fingers and toes are just starting to differentiate and the tail is almost gone. You'd see an upper lip forming, the protruding tip of that cute button nose and tiny, very thin eyelids. The fetus is still inside its amniotic sac and the placenta is continuing to develop, forming structures that help attach the placenta to the wall of the womb. At this stage, the fetus still gets its nourishment from the yolk sac. Heartbeats and movements. All this growing is exciting for your baby, too. How do you know? Your little one's heart is beating at the incredible rate of about 150 to 170 times per minute, roughly twice as fast as yours. And even though you can't yet feel it, baby's tiny trunk and limb buds are now twitching and making spontaneous movements. Amniotic fluid volume is increasing and your womb is expanding to accommodate its growing tenant. How big is my baby at 8 weeks? At a length of about half to three quarters of an inch right now, your little one has graduated from blueberry sized to raspberry sized. Admittedly, that's still pretty small. But while it's unlikely you look pregnant from the outside, you almost certainly feel pregnant on the inside, especially when those insides threaten to come out all day long. Yes, it's that notorious pregnancy rite of passage, morning sickness. Though the name can be misleading. If you're among the estimated 75% of pregnant women who have morning sickness, you know all too well that it may start in the morning, but it can linger all day and all night. No one knows for sure what causes that queasy feeling though theories abound. It could be because of the increased level of HCG and estrogen circulating in your body or the relaxation of the muscles of the digestive tract, making digestion less efficient, due to rising progesterone levels or the rapid stretching of the uterine muscles. Whatever the cause, take heart, your baby feels just fine, even while you're hugging the bowl. Try to eat often. But only a little at a time, which should also help your body battle another stubborn woe coming your way soon, pregnancy heartburn. If you're really struggling with morning sickness, say, you've lost at least 5 pounds or can't keep anything down for more than 8 hours. Ask your doctor whether you should take a pregnancy anti-nausea drug. The good news, however, is that nausea and vomiting usually subside by weeks 12 to 14, so hang in there, only 4 to 6 more weeks until you get some relief. You at 8 weeks. Your womb has grown to the size of a lemon by the time you're around 7 or 8 weeks pregnant. You're probably feeling tired. Your breasts might feel sore and enlarged, and you're probably needing to pee more often than usual. You'll probably have missed your second period. But you may experience a little bleeding in pregnancy from your vagina. Always mention any bleeding in pregnancy to your midwife or GP, particularly if it continues and you get stomach pain. Eating fruit during pregnancy. Fruit is always your friend, but consider it your best friend while you're expecting. Yes, nature's sweetest bounty contain essential vitamins and other nutrients that are good for you and your baby. Things to think about this week. Find out about the pregnancy, antenatal, care appointments you'll be offered, including your first midwife appointment. Learn about infections that can harm your baby in pregnancy and how to protect yourself. Find out about exercise and keeping fit in pregnancy. Make and save a pregnancy to-do list to help you stay organized. That has been Pregnancy Week 8. If you got any value from this video, hit the subscribe button. Subscribe to the channel and don't ever forget, you know how to mom.